Well, that was a bitch to get working. <clears throat> you got it? Yeah. Alright, so create your. Already right, did. Okay. So you're ready to go? Yeah. Nice. Okay. Let me get out of this. Uh, so you've watched gameplay of this? Yeah. Okay. So, let's see, I have to... You know, let you know, I only got about an hour. Um, is your name just Extremicide? Yep. I'm gonna get an invite from Juice. Oh, no, no, Juice, man. Freaking people spamming me. <laughs> there we go. All right, so the next screen you're going to see is a map. I don't know if you saw this part of the gameplay, but basically it's, a, it's an overview of the map. And you can select where you want to go. You can select where you spawn. It's not like you drop in like other ones. Um, but the, the the thing is, is you can also see where everyone else is going to start as well. So since you're learning, we're going to start somewhere as far away from people as possible, but people can still choose to spawn next to us. So we'll, we'll see what we can do. <clears throat> so in order to spawn next to each other or in the same area as one another we can yeah we can spawn in the same exact spot you see the map right now yeah you can click on any one of those grids that you want all the blue dots are obviously other people on the right hand of the screen you have to select the pack you want so it's your means of getting around i personally like the grappling hook and the glider um i haven't really messed with bmx that much but i like the grappling hook a lot because you can get you on top of buildings for really real quick and stuff but um let's try to go over here uh, a lot top left click on the you can, you bay, can click on me, bay right next to me yeah you can click on anyone you can click right on me it's, and should i do glider or grappling hook first uh do grappling yep the team started here Hopefully we can kill them real quick, and I'll be able to explain some stuff to you. Just go in the buildings and look for loot as quick as you can. Turn your volume, uh, yeah. Turn your volume headset all the way up if you haven't. Footsteps, footsteps are pretty much everything in this game. You'll know when someone's coming by their footsteps. They're pretty loud, and they'll know when you're coming too. You said someone else spawned here too? Yeah, another team did. They're close. I see him in front of me. I knocked him down. Nope. I'm 
I'm hurt bad. Yeah, I'm knocked down. He's coming at you, grapple hook. Yep. Yeah. yeah, right when I was healing, he knew I was healing. Yep. Yeah. That's what I didn't want to happen. So I have a return to lobby option. That means I'm dead. Yeah, we're done. Yeah. Go ahead and hit ready when you're ready. All of a sudden, I said, yeah, I see him. <laughs> like, what? And all of a sudden, brrr, I'm like, what the fuck? Yeah, I unloaded a whole <laughs> clip into him. Yeah, recoil's a bitch in, in this. I'm, I mean, really, you got a, a big part of it is the attachments that you can find, like the handguards and stuff like that, and compensators. Like, they really help. Because if you don't have them on any weapon, I mean, it's a lot of recoil. So it's kind of a bitch. that and armor. There's two different types of body armor you can get and two different types of helmets. One's a level one and one's a level two. So that can <coughs> really depend on how you trade with somebody, how much armor they have. Yeah, that, that, he got me down to like five health, and I was trying to just use my bandages just to heal up, which are really slow heals, and he, he knew what I was doing. He pushed me. So I got knocked down, but the guy I was fighting got also got knocked down. Yeah, because I I I knocked him. I shot him down, and then while I was shooting him, his friend was shooting me. So it was kind of like a it was definitely like a four way trade. So he got, he hit me real good. So I got behind those rocks and he took me out. Now I wonder how, like Firestorm, how that it's going to load everybody in. Like I wonder like what the, you know, because other games they drop you from a plane. This one's different because you can choose. We'll probably have to pair drop in. Yeah. Let's try down here, Bay City at the left, bottom left. People spawn by us. We'll go up here. We'll go up to the castle. Up top. So we just need time. We need time to get through this. Personally, I like spawning around other people up right off the bat because it warms me up. Because if you go a long time without shooting in this, I don't know. I always have bad luck. Ah, somebody spawned right there at the last second. It's okay, though. So if you hit tab, I don't know if you've done that yet. That shows you what's on the ground in front of you. Like if you don't want to just pick it up, if there's like a bunch of stuff on the ground in one space, you can hit tab and you can right click or click on it to drag it over. Um, you can also like change around your attachments and stuff on certain weapons. But right now, if you pick up an attachment, it'll automatically go on the weapon you have out if it if it fits. Was that you grappling? Yep. Okay. I 
I feel like our guys run so damn slow. Yeah, it's different, right? It's different than uh, Battlefield. It's a pretty normalized running speed, like, as far as, like, more realistic running speed. And that tab also lets you see your armor, like your helmet and your body armor. Like, because sometimes I forget if I if I picked one up or not. You can see if you actually have it on. So what I usually try to go for is one close quarters gun, another long range, if possible. You can technically equip three guns, you can get rid of your primary, um, if you wanted to. But I always like to try to get at least, at least one long range, one close quarters, and then meds, like health packs and stuff like that. Always be on the lookout for those. A superior bulletproof vest. Where are you going over there? You exploring? Found the donut shop with a cop car. Did you find a helmet yet? Yeah. Yeah, you have to go through the buildings. I mean, the buildings are where you're gonna get everything. No, I'm just saying, I found an extra helmet if you needed one. Oh yeah. I'm good, man. What I do need is like a 4x scope or a 2x or something. Somebody spawned over here where I'm running. This is where they spawned. Now do you see the, the white line on your map? On your mini map, there's like a white dotted line. Yeah. That's pointing towards the direction we have to go because the storm's coming in. And we can't be here, so we have 4 minutes and 33 seconds right now to get out of this area, or we're dead, basically. So, let's see, where, how far is it? Oh my god, really freaking far. It's the exact opposite corner of the map. We might be kind of screwed here, actually. Unless we leave right now. Let's... Go, let's do it. Yeah. <clears throat> Got yourself some weapons and shits. Yeah, um...
No scopes or anything, though. Looks like we might have a vehicle over here, though. That's me. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. I'm coming with one. Oh my god, I was wondering if we were gonna find a porta potty soon. <laughs> I'm looking how we should drive. Can we get... No, we have to take this... Shit. This isn't good. We're gonna get shot at. We have to cross this big bridge. Hopefully everyone's running. A second. Do we really have to? Yes, we do. Shh. Take the second one over here. There's an airdrop over here too. See that smoke? Yes. Yeah, that's an airdrop. Inside of airdrops they have better armor or weapons. There's a lot of players around here. Say we check this out real quick. Very careful. So if you wear a helmet and you pick up another helmet, it automatically puts the more powerful one on you? It, yeah, well, it, it'll just switch them out. There's another, another vehicle coming here. They just drove right by. This is kind of a key point right here because a lot of people are going to be coming and driving through if somebody else is coming. Somebody's fighting over there. They're down by the water. I need a scope so bad. Yeah, I can't fight. Can't fight here. I'm not gonna shoot. I'll wait for them to come in here. We're gonna have to keep moving though. Look at the map here. I see somebody. Shit your song if I'm saying that right. Thank you for the follow. Good afternoon. I marked where they were over there. We're going to have to come through this town. We'll wait. Over here. Let's just Don't get down there and get back in our vehicle and take off. You want to do that? I kind of want to kill him. <laughs> I want to try. Yeah, well, I wish we had a scope. I don't have freaking nothing. I know. Not a fan of Iron Sight. Sure, we can go. Yep. 
You in? Yep. <clears throat> to me, it'd be more humiliating if we got freaking knocked down by the cloud or the ash or whatever you call it in this game. <laughs> it happens. Sometimes you get just stuck in a bad spot. And so you need you need sights. So we have to find some buildings or something. There's a building up here. I don't know if there's anything here. We'll get this high ground now. Yeah, it's not already taken. Yeah. What am I hearing? Like I said. <laughs> yeah, I knew it. I had a feeling. <laughs> right when I got stuck up there, they just shot us down. Hmm, where to go? How about White Shore up there? Where's that at? Uh, White's Moor or White's Shore or whatever. It's top center. Click on it because I can't see what you're talking about. We don't have time. There it is. They left. There's not gonna be a lot of loot here for both of us. get lucky some good stuff Got a bolt action sniper rifle. Yeah, it's got a Remington. But you need a scope for it. For it to be worth a damn. Found a lot of med kits. Wow, that, and that comes with a scope. I actually haven't found a helmet yet. I haven't found any health kits. I haven't found any body armor or head armor. Body over here, body armor over here in this garage. Hey, real quick, come to me. 
Where are you at? I'm all the way over the farm. Oh shit. Can you find the armor yet? Uh, head armor, that's it. Okay, let me know if you see an extra helmet. There we go, I got, a <coughs> got body vest now. Okay, I just found a helmet. Do you need, uh, like dots, red dots or anything? No, I'm good right now. Did you find med kits? I got a, uh, I got a Mosin and I got an MP5. And I hear gunshots over here. Is it close? Close enough. I'm trying to catch up with you. Check out these houses up here on the hill. Yeah. Found a nice convertible. Helmet where I'm at, if you need one still. I just found one. Good now. That's pretty close. Uh, it sounds like it's on the other side of this mountain. Do you have any scopes or anything? Do you have any scopes? And the gun I'm using, but it doesn't really zoom in. Well, if you click Q, by the way, if you look at something and click Q, it does that. So if you want to tell me where somebody is, if you see somebody. See, now the thing to think about is that people might be coming this way that we came. Because this is the zone. Everyone's running to this edge. I mean, there's, there wasn't that many down by our side, but there is enough south that... People could v could very well come from this way. That's what you have to think about. So, which direction should we be heading right now? Well, it's really anyone's guess. We can go into this city. There's a city over here. That's the thing. You can basically play it however you want to play it. Depending on the situation, sometimes I'll wait on the edge just to see if people come up. But going to the city is going to be pretty risky. 
at the same time as well, so. And over to the right there is an airdrop, so players are definitely seeing that, and they're going to head that way. Be wary of this edge because people will be coming from this from somewhere. Doors are open there. Someone's already been in there. Let me see if he's actually close. Yeah, that's down this. Gunshots down here. Now oh, these are actually that, always open. And that airdrop is right there, man. It's right there. You want to try for try for it? Oh, that's far. No, it's. I can actually see it from up here. It's pretty far. That was me. I actually want to see what's going on in this city over here. Somebody's here, a vehicle. No, that's far away. Oh, I see a player. in this building. Kinda wanna shoot. It's not me. Is that you? Yes. Oh my god. He was on a BMX. Oh shit. Shit. <laughs> I didn't realize what you were doing. Thanks for having my back. I didn't even... Well, you didn't say anything. <laughs> I had no... <laughs> you kept saying he's there. He's in this building, so I'm creeping up on it, creeping up on it, and all of a sudden he jumps through the window on a BMX. <laughs> no, that was a different... That was a different team. Are you spectating me? Yes. Oh. Yeah, you got a guy right in front of you. So are you going to be on tomorrow? Um, maybe for a little bit in the morning. I do have to go. Well, let's get a game plan. In the morning, do you want to jump in the battlefield or do you want to jump into this? It's up to you. I could jump into this until you have to leave and then hit battlefield. I just fell. Fuck. Now they got the high ground on me. Fucked. <laughs> Bitches. rock these guys. Damn. 
Think I can do it, X? No, but I'm still cheering you on. <laughs> Thank you, sir. I appreciate it. I need that support. I gotta, like, drop some of this stuff. I got way too much stuff. Kicks! I don't want that shotgun anymore. What do they got? So, Ring of Elysium. It's on Steam. It's free. <clears throat> it's a PUBG clone, and it's actually, so far, pretty good, but it's my first time ever playing a one of these uh battle royal games so we're kind of playing this yeah, to kind of get in the mood for uh for firestorm a minute get a little bit of practice seconds. in how far do i have to go okay not that far. shit i need a vehicle Fuck. but considering i never played a battle royal game before for me it's I've watched enough videos where I understand the concept of it and everything. It's just getting used to the uh, the keys because I've never played one before, so I'm not familiar with all the keys. If I can stay hidden, I might be able to sneak on the chopper. It's possible. Okay, so what exactly is the chopper? It's the last zone. I want you to see it. That's the thing. It's like... It's the very last. Oh, so you're trying to be one like one of the survivors from this ash, and you're trying to get to the, get to the chopper. Get to the chopper. Exactly. Yeah. That's so. Yeah. The, basically, the island, the entire area is about to be fucked by a volcano. Is this like in development, and they're planning to actually charge at some point? Yeah. You're heading into the ash. No, I'm, I'm trying to run out of it. See, it's hurting me. It's... <clears throat> well, that wall there looks intimidating as fuck. I wouldn't be trying to run into that shit. I know. <laughs> See, I would have probably died right there. I don't know where to go! Probably one of the worst things to do in this game is actually sit still like this, but I had to heal. It's just kind of getting lucky. And I need this high ground. I don't want to stay low. So, there's, but there's definitely be people up here too. So, Let's see how far do I have to go? Not far. It right actually here. operates really yeah. smooth and everything. For a PUBG clone, it's uh, I'm I'm pretty impressed. I guess I have to worry about three sides instead of four. Nope. Shorter Somebody queues close. than battle uh, battlefield. This is a nice little spot right here. I bet you when you tried to play this game last time, a lot of people didn't know of it, which is why you probably had some long ass cues. Yeah. Yeah, but now, uh, yeah, it's getting more, definitely getting more hype. This is a good spot I have here, but I'm worried about people coming behind me. Let's see how much, there's actually not much space. If I can survive this, we'll be able to see the helicopter at least. I don't know if I'll actually make it. Well, besides yourself, there's only five others right now. Yep. So I'm going to be a puss and just wait. But regardless, this, this will be the last game. Like I said, the wife will be leaving work here at 3.30. Yeah. Somebody far, far away over there. You saw that? Yep. I was really worried about this tree line. That's where people are going. So it's you and four others now. Yep. But we only saw the one guy. Two other teams. So if I let these two other teams fight it out, 
if they like are two other teams, you know, you only saw a single guy. Yep, that's. You never know. Yeah, he could be solo. Like you. Yep, but uh, I have a lot of meds. What I really could do to be cheap, because a lot the thing is, is the last helicopter, the last zone, the ash is coming in no matter what, and the helicopter is the only means of escape. So, at a certain point, you start dealing damage because you're in the ash. And the longer you're in the ash, the more damage you, you get. So what a lot of people will do is they'll just sit in one place and keep medding. <laughs> and they'll just try to wait the other person out. Um, you can have basically four people on the helicopter. So as long as there's as long as one team boards and there's not, not, not another team left, like four people can leave on the same helicopter that are actually enemies as well. I don't know if that makes sense. So but. on the screen I'm on right now, Unless I'm seeing your screen, I, I see R for report spectating player. I guess that would be the report me. Oh, it's right here. <gasps> Look at my screen. Yeah, I see it. This never happens. That's where the hel helicopter is going to be picking up people. I could snipe people if they try to escape. Oh, this is really good. Well, you got that one guy who's definitely real close to that. Yeah, he was over here. So it's like your choice is like you can go, f you can try to make a run early and try to get up the ladder real quick um, or you can wait it out for other people but the thing is if you try to go up that ladder people will start shooting you as you go up the ladder yeah I saw another game like this where uh, I forgot what the hell it's called but you're being chased by werewolves and you're trying to get to the chopper yeah, yeah I heard yeah it's um beware of the wolves or, no it's not, it's not what it calls so, what the hell is it called something like that it's made by some Russian developer. Yeah. But I guess it didn't do well. But there's another one that I'm actually interested in where, uh, I guess the characters you play are all mutated animals, like a duck and a pig. And you'd have to see the trailer, but it actually looks freaking pretty funky. What do you think? Should I wait it out, or should I try to make a run to the helicopter? How long is that chopper going to stay there? Um, well, it's going to be two minutes until the ash comes in. And after that, it's just for as long as however we can survive in the ash. I have a lot of men, but no one's going for the helicopter. Everyone's sitting and waiting to see if anyone goes for it right now. That's what's happening. Everyone's waiting. I would circle this perimeter. Um, I see somebody right here. Get him. What? Go, go get closer. Circle the perimeter. There's one to the right of the guy you're shooting at. To the right of him. Behind him. I saw a guy in that tree line. Killed his buddy at least, so I ruined their day. I think there's another somebody else shooting at me too. Someone's shooting down by the chopper. Shit. Let's see, so what's gonna happen? We got three onboarded players. All player position will be revealed in 15 seconds. I don't care about that guy down there. I care about this guy over here. That's why you don't sit okay. still. You're all revealed now. I'm stuck. Oh god. Stop. This guy gonna try to push me? It's you and two others. Oh, they're right underneath the helicopter. 
Oh shit, I'm gonna die. You're gonna die. Fucking shit. Get to the chopper! Because I guarantee they're all healing like this also right now. Yep. Get to the chopper! Hey, you got rank two though. Yep. I got four well players. Done.